Hey everyone, Techno Mentor here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix check your charger connection message warning that you might get whenever you're looking to charge your phone. Here I have a Samsung phone and we're going to show you how to fix that. So usually when you get this message, it's because the connection between your charger and the phone is not working like it should. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and make sure that whatever charger connection port here, take this apart and then put it back in again. So you wanna make sure it fits perfectly, just like that. As you see here, you don't want it to be loose or like hanging out or disconnected. It needs to be fully connected. And whenever you're charging, make sure the charger is not broken or damaged. If sometimes you might have to replace the cable or the block itself, if that's the case, if it's a defective, especially if the cable is ripping. Also, you wanna make sure that there's no dust or lint here. Maybe take a brush or examine it or the toothpick to take out any dust or lint. Sometimes it can get in there, get in there, or even right in here. So you wanna really thoroughly look for that to fix that as well. Other thing you also wanna consider is then making sure this is dry. If you've got liquid or water or anything on it, if it's wet, this connection, you just wait till it dries out before reconnecting it. Same goes for the charger port itself on your Samsung phone or any phone. You wanna make sure there's no lint or dust. Take a Q-tip or something basically to clean it out. Take a flashlight to take a look to see there's no buildup of it, buildup of any dust or debris that needs to be taken out. And once you do that, go ahead and make sure the connection is fully connected. Even here, if the connection is, doesn't fit in fully or there's a gap, that's gonna cause that message to pop up. So you're gonna make sure it's fully connected both ends and try a different charger to make sure that it's not a defective charger that you have. And then always make sure that if this charge report is wet or liquids in it, just make sure it's dried out, just tap it, keep it out for a few hours to dry it. Now, if you're still getting it and you know it's not the charger, it's connected, you're gonna just go ahead and restart your phone. So go from the top here or using the but the buttons here, so you can always use the volume down and the side button from the top here. If you scroll a little bit further down, there's a restart option. Just go ahead and restart the device just like that. And sometimes that also will help, especially resetting any warning message that you do not expect by clearing the cache and reloading the phone software as well. Now, along with that here, the final and the last step you also want to do is consider updating the software of your phone. Sometimes a previous firmware might have caused charging issues or errors that you're seeing. So it's always good to update the software, which I'll show you how to do that once the phone is back on. So again, these are going to be the reason why you're seeing it. Again, when you see that message, again, nothing is particularly wrong with the phone itself. It's just a charge connection and maybe the software itself so here once it restarts again we will go ahead and do a software update and usually in the settings you can do the update if you already know where to do it go ahead and do that so i'll show you on here i'll swipe up get into my settings and usually in the about or software update you'll see an option to update your phone you should set all set if not you can go ahead and check for update here See if there's an update out here. I have updated already fully, so it's good to go. But if there's an update, we'll go ahead and update it as well. So that's all you need to do to fix this. I hope this video was helpful. If so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your phone. We'll see you guys next time.